A 27-year-old Texas woman accused of killing a college student in an alleged drunken driving crash told police she drank a single margarita at a nearby dog bar with her husky named Tequila before climbing behind the wheel. Subscribe my channel for more breaking news. Lindley Paulus admitted to running a red light in her Lexus and crashing into the car of Southern Methodist University sophomore honor Elizabeth Wallace, 19, killing her, the Dallas Morning News reported. Wallace's passenger suffered a broken collarbone in the collision that occurred about 4 p.m. Sunday on Monticello Avenue and the North Central Expressway Service Road, according to an arrest affidavit obtained by the local newspaper. Paulus, a University of Kentucky graduate, told police she had just left a trendy bar with a dog park called Mutt's Canine Cantina. After taking her medication for ADHD, she allegedly told police she had imbibed one drink, then drove off with tequila. Paulus, who suffered minor injuries, was interviewed at the hospital. Police noted in the arrest affidavit that she had glassy eyes, slurred speech and smelled of alcohol. She was charged with intoxication manslaughter and intoxication assault and was released on a $100,000 bond. After the crash, Paulus appears to have deleted her Instagram and Facebook pages, which had featured numerous snaps of her drinking and hanging out with her pooch, tequila. Her LinkedIn profile says she is a hospitality management professional who most recently worked at Vandalay Hospitality Group, which operates about 10 high-end restaurants. An attorney for Paulus could not immediately be identified. A resident of Monticello Avenue told Fox 4 that he heard the crash from inside his home and ran outside to help. It was horrible, horrible, Ron English said. I've thought about it all week, especially when I found out how young they were. His neighbors pulled Wallace from the car and performed CPR, but she was already gone, he said. The university released a statement to Fox News Digital mourning the passing of Wallace. The SMU community is deeply saddened by the tragic death of Honor Wallace, said K.C. Mahay, vice president for student affairs. Honor was a valued member of our community, and we offer our heartfelt condolences and support to all who are affected by this loss. An email sent out to faculty and students said that Wallace, of Gross Point, Michigan, had just started her sophomore year and was pursuing degrees in Spanish and English.